Hello, ladies and germs. I know, I know, I know. We have a Theros Beyond Death Epic Bundle Battle Green Screen Edition. Uh, this is going to be Brian vs. Brian. Coom vs. Taft. Man, it's been a long time coming. Good luck to you gentlemen. This goes for winner takes all. Loser goes home with nothing. Good luck. Value matters. Current TCG player pricing. I'm very interested to see where the prices are at right now myself. So let's do this, Brutus Skadoosh. Oh boy. Good luck. This is going to be to determine who's the luckier, Brian. Brian Coon or Brian Taft. All right. Just high roll. I got both bundles right here in my hands, but both. I'm just going to go for this one. Highest roll takes this one. Good luck. Seven for Mr. Coon. I always start with from the left and go right. And Mr. Taft rolls a four. Oh, my gosh. Taft is flipping out right now. I can tell you that already. I know Taft is flipping out. He's like, ah! <laughs> Taft has played three times. And God, God bless him. Thank you so much, Taft, for participating in this event. Ooh, that knife is so sharp now that I sharpened it. I watched a YouTube video on the sharpest knife sharpener, and I came across this little fella right here. It was like $10. I'm like, sold. So I got a knife sharpener. Pretty awesome. All right. Um, yeah, so... Yeah. <laughs> He's kidding. Coon, I think, is about broke even, or maybe one more time for lost. So, Well, the high roll went to Mr. Coon over here. Let's call him Coon Dog. Don't steal. Bad things will happen. You go to Pound Town Penitentiary, and you get a fist up your bum. You don't want none of that. And then Hulk Hogan comes around, and he gives you a whooping. You don't want none, brother. All right, here we go. So now we got to see what the high roll is here. Coon Dog rolling a 10 for the big old Coon Dog. All right, what else we got here? We got some, some glitter and some stuff. And, uh, yeah, some packages and some things. So that's cool. You do get this weird alternate art here. I'm not going to include the value on here. But it is, I already know off the top of my head, it's like $3.08. Weird I know these things, I know. Very cool little alternate art, but I'm not including it because... Both participants have the exact same. Don't steal, or you're going to be grabbing someone's ankles. Not really. They'll be grabbing your ankles. You're going to, no, you're going to be tucking. You don't want to get, you're going to get goo everywhere on the sale. It's going to be nasty. All right. We don't have much energy today. Sorry, guys. Um, we're going to step it up next time. I do apologize about that. Okay. Boxes. Does anyone use these? Not uh Here we go. Oh, my God. Taft, it all comes down to this, buddy. Taft rolled a 15. Hot dogs. That's really good, actually, Taft. Um, I, I hope you go uh, a far ways in life in this one. Good luck, my good man. Again, the the the, 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 the Rasta, the Rasta, the Rasta, tra -da. All right, good luck, gentlemen. You'll be both receiving the die. Or oh, not both, just one. Only one of you gets the die. So I didn't mean to say both. Only one of you gets the die. The cards, everything. Oh man, showtime! All right, here we go. Starting off a coon dog, yeah. Let's go, guys. This is not a time. This is no, no. This is no funny business. All right. I currently don't believe there's anything worth over twenty five cents in the common slot. I could be wrong, but I doubt it. All right. And commons, I'll I'll, I'll bleed, breeze through a little bit. I know feel the ruins up there. Basically, anything over twenty five cents is counted in the value. That's how it's always been done. That's how we're going to do it. Um, and all un, um, all foils, all rares, all mythics, doesn't matter the value on them. They all get tallied in. Natty or a Kraken, a little tiny bit of value with a foil Daxos, blessed by the sun. Coondog starting off uh, probably around $2 already in value, $3 in value. I'm not going to include any of these... Um, any of these lands, I, I mean, I know some of them are over 25 cents. I do understand, but both you guys are getting a ton of lands in each one of your packs. If it really comes down to it, and it comes down to, like, pennies, you know what I'm saying? If it comes down to, like, the winner won by, like, 30 cents or something, I'll include the lands, okay? Like, then I'll really be like, okay, this is this is crazy, and I'll have to go back through it again. But so far, yeah, not going to include the lands. Um, I'm not sure if Omen of the Sea, I know some, maybe some of these Omens might be worth a, a penny or something, not sure, or a few pennies. Uh, we got uh, this Enemy of Enlightenment. Some of these cards, I don't even know what the heck they do. I haven't really played with too many yet. Furious Rise. There you go, the Furious Rise. Interesting enchantment. Nick's Herald, some bish. Uh, Treacherous Blessing for Taft over here. Treacherous Blessing. I love playing with this card. Anytime I make a black deck, it's always in there. 
Like 100%. It's always in there. Oh, Taff dropping dynamite. Oh, my voice is still cracking. Uh, Scooby. Dream Trawler. There you go. Foil Dream Trawler of all things. Nice pool, my friend. Nice pool right there. Wowzers in the trousers. Doing good, my buddy. Doing good. Doing good. Taft is probably really excited about that guy. Definitely. <laughs> Excuse me, guys. Oh, boy. All right. Moving along. We got Ikea over here. I thought about Tom and Atars. The plummet. Of this guy, the that guy. Oh, boy. Here we go. Down to the uncommons. We got Inevitable End. We have Mr. Fierce Band over there. The Fierce Band. Hero of the Winds and Elspeth Conquers Death. Throwing around some lava over there. Oof. I know that sees a lot of play. Not sure the value on it, but that could be helping out a lot. Indomitable Will, which will absolutely be included in the value here. Good for you, my friend. Good for you. Planes and nada. I want to see someone pull like uh, an extended art or something. These are This is four bundles. And I purchased the, all four of these bundles out of the exact same case. So, um, yeah, this is a, this, this will be a total of four bundles we've opened on the channel. All, and they all came from the same case. So, odds of you guys pulling something pretty decent out of this, you know. Someone's got to pull, like, a hit, you know, something crazy. Hateful Eidolon. There you go. That, your card is seeing some play. Not sure the value. Bloodass Pirate. Not bad. Might be one of the ones over 25 cents. It could be wrong. Hero of Nick's Born. I seem to always pull this card. And the Akron War. Fun little card to play with. Definitely is. Uh, gain control of target creature. Blah, 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 blah. I like that you can steal someone's creature. Don't steal! Bad things will happen to you. All right, and a Swamp and a Human Soldier. There you go. All right, so Coon, nothing too crazy that second one. I'm sorry, Taft, nothing too crazy that second one. Um, back to Coon we go. Let's go, pal. Memory Drain, fun card. We got Final Flare Ups. That's right. Uh, blessing. Everyone needs one. That's right. See God Scorn. Oh, man, that's, that's not good. The God's like, I'm just going to squirt all over the place. Okay, that's weird. Uh, Careless Celebrons. All right. Warden of the Chained and probably a Temple of Enlightenment because I always pull them. Kiora Best the Sea God. Mythic. That's some value for Coon over there. I know it's one of the less sought after ones, but nonetheless, my friend just pulled a Mythic. Taft is probably getting a little nervous right now. I'm not even going to lie. Um... I've known both these Bryans for quite some time, but, oh, whoops, my bad. I am rooting for Taft, slightly. Coon Dog's probably mad as hell at me right now. I think I've known Coon Dog longer than Taft, by um, probably by a long shot, too. But, man, I, I, Coon, I'm sorry, bro. But uh, my heart goes out to him because he's been such a pathetic loser, you know? And um, I got a heart for the underdog, man. That's why I root for myself. All right, here we go. Here we go. Soul Guide Lantern. That'd be cool in Mythic, that little, or on foil, that little uh, light right there. Whoosh, you know, we don't got one, though. Uh, Wolf Willow Haven. It's like 20-some cents. Might be over the, the mark. We'll see. Arkham of the Falling Stars. Great for a limited. And Temple of Malice. All right. I think this, right, right now, this has to be a neck-and-neck neck kind of one. I think Taft might even have a slight advantage. Let's see. Oosh. Well, there you go. All right. Now we know. Coon Daft. Or, I call him Coon Taft. Coon dog back in the house. All right, good luck. Good luck to you, coon boy. Good luck to you, my good man. All right. Yeah, again, not really much value in the common slot at all, unfortunately. Soul Guide Lantern. Impending Doom. Staggering Insight. That might bring in a little jangle. That might be over 25 pennies. That's a good card right there to use. It really, really is. All right. And whoa. Whoa. What's going on with you today? What is, what, is, what, is going, what is going on with you today, Scoops? Elspeth conquers death. Your second one. Oh, your second one in here. What's going on with that? That's weird. That's your second one. Look at all these. Look at like. like oh, and the Kiora. Wow. You're really pulling some weird stuff. Got Arena Trickster and all of its foilness. There you have it, my friend. Uh, that's a little bit of value. Swampy. And that's it. Oh, Mr. Coon Dog. That is odd, but hey, I guess it happens. I think we've seen something similar to that in the last bundles we cracked. So I guess it's not too crazy to, to think about. All right, now we're up to the Uncommons. Glimpse of Freedom. Oh, get that focus. Uh, that's not, I don't like that we can't focus right there. That was not pretty cool. All right, Glimpse of Freedom. Underworld Fires. Petitioner. And Ox of Agonus. 
Wow, really taking it to pound town over on our friend, aren't you, Mr. Taft? Not too shabby. Island and human soldier. I got to give it to Coon, or not to Coon. I got to give it to Taft right now. I think Taft has pulled ahead. He has pulled ahead. The high roll in the end, did he turn, did, it did say Taft was going to win. And that high roll doesn't lie. It, it does not lie ever. Ever. Even if there's a fire. Timerit. We got Timerit. That's right. Reverend Hoplite. Shimmerwing Camara. Whoa, Strider. All right. Tiny bit of value there. Um, it's enough to, to bring us out of this grave we're in right now. Coon, you have to step it up, my friend. You're all, you're here, you're hearing the threats, man. Coon, you have to step it up, pal. All right, you, you've seen better days. You really got to step it up. Let's go, let's go. Wings, this, that, sleep, thirst, meaning, forge, four, runner, empathy, apathy. There we go with a dust. Cling to dust. Come on, baby. Shimmering Camara. Staggering insight. Probably some pennies there. Thrix, the sudden storm. That's right. Did I just open the wrong guy's pack? It's all going the same place. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four. No, this is Coon. I just put him. I put him in the wrong pack. Um, here, let's, let's not predict the winner yet. There we go. Let's go back over here. Just grab a few cards. There you go. You can have those back. Doesn't matter. They're all going the same guy. Um, doesn't really matter what order they go in. Swampy and a satyr. All right, did I do that right? No, that was supposed to go to Taft. Those were all Taft's cards. Uh, yeah, about that. Here you go. You can have them all back, Taft. I apologize, man. Here's some stuff. All right, now we're all better. Man, I don't know what happened there. That's what happens if you don't have your meds, kids. All right, back to Coon Dog we go. <laughs> so what'd you get out of that one? He got the Thrix, the su uh, the Sudden Storm for, uh, rare there. That was his That was his big pool. If you guys ever wonder why that stuff happens, I had a really bad head injury. Um, God, it's been like almost eight years now. Uh, eight years ago, I was bleeding from the brain. Like, I almost died. And uh, things have not been the same since then. Like, I have extremely bad, poor memory. Um, I just forget to do things, you know, just normal tasks. It's, it's pretty bad. It's it's a real thing. It's, it's It was my third concussion, but this one almost killed me, and it was really bad. So now you guys know a little bit more about Joy Moss and why all the love mistakes are made on the channel and sometimes why I talk funny. And why I gave birth to Melodus over here. There you go. All right. Mantle of the Wolf popping out. And that is garbage, my friend. I wish you would not have pulled that. All right. I got to pick it up here. So Taft is up at it. Um, that's why you'll see miss, like a lot of misplays when I'm playing Magic sometimes. Because, um, yeah, I just, like, the short term is just gone, you know. And only a few things really do stand out in my memory. Usually of things that, like, are upsetting or frustrating, like, those things will stand out in my memory or something because my blood gets boiling. I don't know. But um, uh, a lot of other things, just I don't remember them. It's, it's messed up. Sage of Mysteries, basically. That's right. Uh, Sage of Mysteries with Escape Velocity. And there you go. Hoplite. And shatter the sky, throwing up a few more pennies. Let's see some more value out of these, man. I feel like the value has been really dudley. I feel like on both of these, um, like under fifteen bucks on Taft, under under ten bucks on Coon right now. That's how I'm feeling. I mean, it could be there could be a little bit more value. I don't know. It's just what I, I got a feeling that Omen in the Sea is gonna infuriate the Moss Viper into a existence that nobody knows until we escape velocity. It's gonna have to rise to glory and drag everyone to the underworld and Perforus's intervention stops the underworld from happening. And we go back to the forest where the peasants rejoice with the goats. That's all I got. Ah, uh, there we go. Alright, moving along. Back <laughs> over to Brian Taff. Mr. Taff. How many licks does it take to get into the center of the Tootsie Pop? Let's, I never made it without biting. Let's ask Mr. Owl. Elspeth's Nightmare. All right. A little something there. Come on, buddy. A little something. A little something. Dreamstalker Manticore. That is cool. Cloth of design. Nothing. Underworld Breach. Seeing a lot of play. Taft. Ah, you might pull this one out. Oh, well, we're not a call to the hunt. Sadly, it's probably like around only 20 cents. It's ridiculous, huh? Cool little card there, though, but they printed the crap out of these. Planes and that card over there. All right, um, right now, I got to say, it's looking like Taft. It might seal the deal here, but at any moment, Coon can run away with it, like, really, really fast. We've seen it before. Well, that was really off-centered, huh? Uh, maybe it just looks like it. No, nah, it's a little off-centered. Okay, moving on. Plummet, Flummox, Kermis, Ender. Here we go. Gotta get that value. Sage of Mysteries. Ooh. Lasagna. The band story. 
Eat to Extinction. Cool little card, but you know, it's, it's just kind of cool. Cool little card. There you go. Eat to Extinction. With an island and a wolf. Oh boy. Down to three. Uh, yeah. Uh, third. Uh, well, after this, we got two packs for each guy. Good luck, Brian. <laughs> That's right. Okay. We got one with the stars. Don Evangel. Hydra's Growth. Fun card, but more for memes, you know. Because, uh, yeah, just get blown out. Temple of Plenty. There you go. Not one Temple of Enlightenment yet. This might be like a sign of the times. Things might change around for us for good. Uh, Island and this little thing. Thing about Bobber. Oh, boy. Coon. Back. Oh, Coon. Coon, your pile of commons. Or you, you just you just smacked all of Tav's cards everywhere. What were you thinking? Oh my goodness. What were you thinking? Right, here we go. Uh, this is for Brian Coon. Good luck. The Drain. I think that was him talking smack over there. Uh, entrancing Lear. Liar? Whatever. I'm sure she is. Uh, Chris Jesus Chimera. Repel, repeal, and temple of abandon. All oh, hope is abandoned you so far in this one, huh? How about that there, Coon? Sentinel's eyes. Ooh, it almost feels like there's more stuff back here, and there is. Um, the planes and a human soldier. There you have it. All right, nothing too crazy out of that. That's why I'm splitting these ones up. Doesn't really matter. Uh, Coon, you need a big one in that last pack, or you're just dead. Like, you're done for. I've noticed the bundles... Um, if we don't hit anything big, the bundles are terrible. This is four bundles that have just brought, like, crap value. Not not cool. I do not recommend purchasing them. Um, from what I've seen so far, this has been really, really bad. Uh, Tim Rick calls the dead. Okay, there is that. Uh, mountain and a Kraken. Yeah, I gotta be honest. Um, this is the fourth bundle we've opened on the channel. And the value... Nothing has really stood out. The value's just been kind of like, eh, you know? And the mythic count isn't even that high. I think one box had three mythics in it. Well, one bundle of three mythics in it. You know, nothing too impressive. Underworld Dreams might be a little bit. This card might be gaining momentum as well. Um, but just really, I'm not impressed with these. Allure of the Unknown. Yeah, like I don't seem to pull much value out of them. It could just be my bundles. But, I mean, four bundles is a pretty good sample size. Um, to, to tell you what you can expect out of these, not good, not good at all. Um, Coon, yeah, that was your last pack, man. You didn't make it happen, Captain. Uh, I, I do, I am, I'm sincerely sorry, Coon. I at least hope Taft goes out with a big bang here and gets something really good. Conorus, Hound of Athria. See what I'm saying? Like, the value is just not here. Like, it's hiding somewhere else. Uh, Soul Reaper of Mogus, like, I just don't get it. There you go. All right, uh, so let's throw the total overall value on here. Gentlemen, both of you, thank you so much for participating, um, just for craps and giggles. I mean, I will just include the prices on the uh, Arasta. Of the, well, I'll open these. Well, I'll open one just to show you guys what's in it. The rest is a bunch of, like, crap. Um, it's just a bunch of foil uh, planes here. Bunch of, bunch of, bunch of, bunch of, bunch of foils. So, a bunch of, bunch, of, bunch of foil planes and swamps and mountains and, yeah. That's it. But here's that really cool card, the Arasta of the Endless Web. Not too bad. Cool art on that. Get a load of them spideys, huh? That's fun. Nasty little artwork. All right, guys. That is the whole kit and caboodle. Thanks for tuning in. Make sure you punch that like button. That's helped out a lot. And uh, thank these two gentlemen for having the guts to do this. I mean, that's really, really gutsy of them. So, thank you. Skadoosh.